Hello guys, hello everyone, this is International Master Asav Givon here and I want to welcome you to this new chess course about the peace exchanges. So with this new course we are going to discuss a lot of different types of um, strategic uh, exchanges that occur in chess. Just to illustrate this, I've actually put one uh, position just in front of you to illustrate kind of an exemplary position, a very typical chess position, chess scenario where both sides have a lot of different options to exchange their own pieces for the enemy pieces. They can try to make those exchanges immediate or try to initiate some exchanges in the future, see under which conditions also they might want to make these exchanges sometimes we do want to exchange certain amount of pieces but we don't want to make them just right now so basically in this course we're going to talk about a lot of different aspects of the peace exchanges when to exchange pieces how to exchange pieces what kind of things do we even strive to to get when we are exchanging pieces what kind of things do we want uh, for the opponent not to be able to achieve when we exchange pieces and basically a lot of good tips about how to manage the piece exchanges in the chess game we are going to talk about the piece exchanges in the middle game mainly we're going to be talking about some uh, transitions to an end game by exchanging pieces how do we reach basically a scenario of a good end game for us by exchanging a lot of pieces also we are going to talk about more general piece exchanging scenarios how to ease space disadvantage how to activate your pieces by using some piece exchanges how to use piece exchanges to create some weaknesses for the opponents or how to just isolate some very bad enemy piece by exchanging a lot of other pieces we are going to also talk about that we will see later on what does it mean exactly and I really hope that this course will bring a lot of new ideas for the for whoever watches it for whoever tries to learn new things about chess strategy so really without any further ado I hope everybody a lot of good luck and a lot of fun watching this video I hope you enjoy every part of it see if you can implement some ideas from this course in your own games for this also we would have the practical test at the end for everybody to try to test their abilities to see if they really learn something that they can try to implement those ideas in their games and also wanted to uh, thank the remote chess academy for producing this course it was a really great pleasure so i'll see you guys there thank you very much see you guys bye bye